Get creative. Come up with low-cost ideas that you can use to grow your business. So some of the things you can do is project the right image. Always look like a professional. Become a great networker. Try and get free publicity to your local media. Speak to them. Tell them stories, interesting stories about yourself. Develop relationships with other business owners that can help you grow your business and you can share ideas. And together you can build a great business by using very creative ways to market your business. Roxanne wasn't your typical entrepreneur. She was an artist. They didn't really want to go into her own business. Roxanne had this little dog, a little sausage dog, and the one day it developed a little rash on its neck because of the collar. So what Roxanne did, she took the, the dog to the vet, and the vet said, you know, you really need to get a collar that doesn't give your dog a rash. So Roxanne took a, the collar off but needed a, a, a collar for this dog. So what she developed is she developed this body harness type of thing that she could put around the dog's body. Anyway, so Roxanne put this, put this on her little dog and guess what happened? As Roxanne started walking around, people started noticing this. So she saw, they saw this great harness. So what do you think happened? People started saying to her, you know, where can I get one of those? And slowly, slowly, Roxanne started going into business. She started becoming, she became this entrepreneur. So she didn't plan it, but she became this entrepreneur. She then became very, very shrewd. What she started using was she started using the little dog as a marketing tool. So uh, Buddy's done a whole lot of things across the country. He's been to a lot of shows. He's been on TV. He's been in the media. And Roxanne has used all these different techniques. Very re regularly, you'll see Roxanne in the newspaper telling the story of how Buddy uses this belt. They are cheap, very, very effective methods to market your business.